name is Mohamed Salem. I'm an interventional cardiologist at the Coordinated Health. I practice mainly out of the uh, Bethlehem campus office. I also go to Allentown and I uh, do procedures also at Easton Hospital. Uh, medicine has been uh, in my mind since I was a child. I have a lot of passion to uh, in dealing with people's pain and, and uh, uh, trying to help them to understand their disease and uh, to me that's even more important to than just treatment uh, because his cooperation and his understanding I think it's uh, uh, almost 50% of the treatment. Um, another thing is that as I uh, got exposed to different fields of medicine, I found cardiology to be the one field that has been a leader in the evidence-based medicine. Cardiolo cardiac disease is, is the number one uh, disease that uh, it claims about a million lives every year. I uh, graduated uh, in Egypt and I came, then came to the United States uh, where I did my training in uh, New York. I did my residency in, in Nashville University Medical Center and then I did my cardiology fellowship at uh, uh, LIJ Medical Center in New York and uh, then I went on to a interventional cardiology fellowship at uh, North Shore University Hospital. It's one of the busiest cath labs in the country. And um, then I had a special interest as well in the peripheral vascular disease so I'm uh, also boarded in, uh, in vascular medicine. Uh, cardiology is uh, is very unique. Uh, is uh, is a is that organ that uh, kind of uh, represent the core and the center of uh, of the body. And uh, without having an adequate what we call cardiac output, then you know most of your body organs are probably not going to be uh, working efficiently. Uh, what I like about coordinated health is, uh, is certainly is the principle of uh, being patient centered. Uh, the, the patient is really uh, the center of attention. The quality of care, the quality of the personnel and the staff, and it certainly has a great record in, in excellence throughout the Lehigh Valley. Uh, coordinated health, as, as the name implies, it's uh, coordinating your care, and I think is, uh, is very important in nowadays to, uh, with the complexity of the medical problem and uh, the the need for a one center where you can get you all of your medical care it's like a one-stop shop kind of concept within the in the cardiology division we have a wide range of services that we uh, provide all uh, aspects of uh, cardiac uh, diagnosis and uh, management from uh, coronary artery disease, heart failure, arrhythmia, and uh, also peripheral vascular disease, uh, and uh, including arteries and venous disease as well. The cardiac catheterization is uh, is a, a very important procedure. Uh, the traditional way of doing this procedure, which is uh, just passing the catheters up to the heart and injecting uh, dye, is usually done from the groin area. We now can access that through the uh, artery of the wrist right here. It's a very, very small uh, incision and it's not even an incision. I would say it's uh, like a, close to a puncture or needle stick. The advantage for them is, uh, is uh, less risk of, of bleeding complication and also early ambulation. The patient can sit up right away, can eat right away and they usually can be discharged within uh, an hour or two. And uh, doing uh, the radiator approach, uh, certainly it's a learning curve. Uh, I've been fortunate to be doing this for over 10 years now and I have a large experience. Um, and it's been the shift in the United States now to try and embrace that uh, approach uh, because of uh, the advantage that we mentioned. Well, to come and see a cardiologist uh, is important whenever uh, you feel like you have you could be having a heart problems. I think uh, it delaying that uh, could be um, problematic. Uh, a lot of the chest pain is not necessarily the heart though, but I think everybody should get a, um, a, his cholesterol checked at least at the age, once at the age of 20. If you have a parent or sibling that is also have been affected, especially at the younger age, then uh, this should be uh, alarming for you to you know, try and get tested earlier. Uh, uh, the Lehigh Valley is a great area. It's uh, very close uh, to the major cities, uh, New York and uh, Philadelphia, and it's also a great place to raise a family. 
uh, and I uh, enjoy uh, living here with my family, my wife and three children, and I uh, spend time with, um, with them uh, mostly and also enjoy soccer and uh, playing golf. Yeah, we get a lot of questions about diet and uh, the only approved, uh, clinically proven diet that is beneficial uh, to the heart is the uh, Mediterranean diet, which is uh, uh, basically rich in fish and, and, and fish oil, olive oil. This, any food rich in the omega-3 uh, fatty acids have been clinically proven and backed up by clinical studies to uh, uh, be heart healthy. Eating healthy and consuming um, uh, more greens and fruits and vegetables uh, than uh, meat and fat uh, will help to control your cholesterol and uh, uh, exercise is extremely important. Uh, this heart is going to carry you until you're 80 or 90 years old. Keeping it healthy is, uh, should be very important and uh, you should pay attention to the risk factors that would put your heart at risk.